Hey, <laughs> Just checked into our hotel room. Maybe is getting ready behind me, looking glam and fabulous as Bonjour, ever. Sarah. <laughs> we are actually here for the weekend for Lottie's hen do. So we're gonna go downstairs to the lobby now to meet the other hens and go to our first stop, which is a gorgeous lunch. I can't actually remember where we're going. Sienna. Sienna. So we're gonna head there now as a group of 16 of us. 16. Can't wait. See you in a bit. <laughs> We are back from a very chaotic lunch. It was absolutely gorgeous. The food was amazing, the vibes were amazing, the games that Amy put together were amazing. But let me give you a little tour of our hotel room. I'm sharing with Maeve for the weekend. Bonjour! <laughs> but this room is absolutely gorgeous, so I'll show you around. Today, which I can't remember if I've showed you or not yet, but I will show you if I haven't. Here's Maeve. <laughs> uh, we Bonjour. woke up this morning. Uh, that's Italian. <laughs> um, we woke up this morning and we went for a little walk and we got a coffee. Um, went to browse the shops but could only find menswear. And then we came back and we're just getting ready now because we are getting picked up at 11.45 in a limo. I did not show you any of last night, but we got dressed up and went to a restaurant called Notto. Um, and these are the only clips that I have from last night evening. So I'm gonna film that. <laughs> So we got home at two and we watched Maeve's wedding video because it's actually her anniversary today. Um, so I am her honorary husband for the weekend. And then we literally had six hours sleep. And so now we're getting ready for round two and we've got a lunch today where the theme is pink. Oh my God, you look gorgeous. Do we think high pony guys? Yes, yes. I can't write down because we've got. High pony. Don't worry, if it rains stuff, I gotcha. <laughs> I got you, queen. We we'll save those crops. <laughs> so we're getting ready now, and everyone's wearing pink, and then Lottie is wearing white. And so we're going to go meet the team, and then head over to I want to say it's called Gigi for lunch. I've never been. So yeah, it's going to be another lovely, lovely day.
so we have had the most amazing day. So we started this morning, we got dressed up in our pink outfits, we got picked up in a pink limo, and we got dropped to the other side of the river to the Eiffel Tower. So we had amazing views. Uh, we got to take in the city, drive through the city, before going to a place called Gigi for lunch, which was gorgeous. I mean, we had to go up like, we were all dressed in these heels and mini dresses, and we had to walk up like nine flights of stairs because the elevator wasn't working, to the point where they had like water waiting on every level because our cardiovascular fitness was just not there. Anyway, so we got to the top. It's a beautiful rooftop re restaurant with the view of the Eiffel Tower in the background, which was just stunning. The food was amazing. We were all so full. And then afterwards, we had some downtime now just to explore Paris between lunch and dinner. So myself and two of the hens, um, Maeve and Courtney, we went shopping in Paris. And oh my God, the clips that I've got, got to show you next are so funny. We went in our outfits and obviously look, we're in like pink outfits. Everyone thought we looked absolutely ridiculous. So every shop we went into, we were like, look, we don't usually shop looking like this. We've come straight from a hen party, um, blah, blah, blah. And the staff were just hilarious and they were loving it. But these clips literally made me die. I felt like we were in Sex in the City running around like headless chickens. Everyone was staring because it was just so ridiculous. Like everyone was in jeans and flats or in these like mini dresses and stiletto heels. So very, very funny. And I hope you enjoy these next few clips. Maeve, <laughs> straight from lunch shopping. Expensive. Shopping at Prada where I can't afford anything. <laughs> but I like that. <laughs> so here she's cruising in Prada. Cruising in Prada. Waiting for Courtney, who's the only one actually shopping. <laughs> Let's go. Let's club. Celine, Dior, Prada. What? We have 40 minutes. I can't listen to this anymore. You need to just move. We don't have time for moaning. I'm running. I kind of love it. I think you need it for Capri. Oh, it's gorgeous. It's just like a glove. <laughs> <laughs> How do you feel, Court? She can't come on. <laughs> I can't actually walk. My plan to fetch the is ruined. <laughs> I look like I've aged about 15 years. What? We've literally been walking around all day going, Club, Club. <laughs> my toes are still sticking up because they're in the shape of my, my, my sandal. Like oh this. <laughs> we just, all of our feet are like this because we went shopping in freaking heels. We lost Courtney. <laughs> my panta fasciitis is ruined. She just put uh, in the group um, in our hen group chat a selfie of her that she did on her bed. And it was just like Paris one, CB zero. <laughs> Um, she's so good. She's so funny. But mm. the plan is we are um, getting unready now to get re-ready because tonight we are going to La Perouse. Maeve and I have been trying to learn French this entire trip as well. Je suis problème. <laughs> Je suis problème. Oh no, what we learned that? Yeah. What was it? Je Salut. Suis... Oh yeah. <laughs> what is the... Salut, something, what, something. What's the actual song? Because I don't remember. It's me. Ha oh, oh je suis. Moi. No, it's c'est moi. Salut. Je suis problème. C'est moi. <laughs> That was it. Right. C'est moi. Salut. Je suis problème. C'est moi. I mean, <laughs> Simon Kyle ain't knocking anytime soon. No, can we tell, can we tell the story of us trying to sort out <laughs> yesterday? So basically, we got moved room. So May stayed here Wednesday, I got here Thursday. I arrived Thursday and you arrived on Friday. But when I arrived on Thursday, they checked me into this beautiful room. Um, with the double opening balcony window, stunning. Mm -hmm. Then they said to me, Madame, we have given you upgrade. And I thought, fabulous. So then when Steph arrived, we went to our room, and you may 
Oh yeah, so then we went to our new room and it just was not the same. Like there was loud noises coming through, the view wasn't as nice. She said it was a bigger room but it felt smaller. It wasn't like, it, there was a giant air conditioning unit outside the bedroom window. It was like, zoom. I thought, mm -mm, mm -mm. Mm -mm. So we were still dressed up and we, we marched downstairs. <laughs> and this poor helpless guy on oh, the desk. Malcolm. Oh, Malcolm, we're friends with him. And he was on the, de the front desk trying to help us. And we were just, he was just like, yeah, I'll see what I can do. You can go back to your room. And they was like, we'll wait. So then he like disappeared. And then we were just cracking up so much because we were just, we were also, you were drunk from lunch. I'd been up since 5 a.m. And Maeve was just like, oh, well, it's like, see, we were leaning over the bar like this, and obviously Maeve's got incredible boobs. So she's like, please help me. And say. So we were cracking up. And then we oh. remembered that scene from Pretty Woman when she's like, 50 bucks, and the grandpa can watch. And then I was like, I don't have any boobs to show him. She was like, sit on the bar and get your ass out. Steph has the oh. best ass ever. Kim K would be so jolly. Anyway, that's the update. We're gonna get unready to get re-ready. <laughs> I'll check in a bit. This whole vlog has literally just been your one-liners <laughs> and different <laughs> restaurants. Do we have time for a disco nap? How do you still look fresh? You still look beautiful. No, I don't. Yes, you do. <laughs> right, the taxi is outside. Let's go. Let's go, girls. <laughs> I'm not a regular mom. I'm a cool mom. Oh my god. <laughs> She's gone crazy. Good morning, everybody. I'm just crossing this beautiful. French Street. Steph and I have two, three more hours left in beautiful Paris and I've just come to find her. She's here at our local coffee shop which is locally owned, Noir. Um, picking up a little, I think she's getting a little oat latte. I decided I would vlog for you. And I'm a YouTuber now. So I'm vlogging. Uh, here she is. And they have the most beautiful, I mean, it, the smell is stunning. <laughs> Steph, I'm vlogging. I'm vlogging. There she is. Should we cross over? Yes. I'm, I'm vlogging for you. I'm going to follow you around today so that you don't actually have to work that booty. This is our hotel that we stayed at in Paris. And look, oh, it's a sex in the city moment. It's a sex in the city moment. Oh, look. Hi, Amy. Welcome to Steph's vlog. What are you wearing today? We've got Chapri's Goyard and Casablanca. She is giving. You look absolutely stunning, by the way. Just gorgeous. And here we have the bride-to-be. Tell us what you're wearing. I've got Jimmy Choo, Rosantica, and Magda Burden. And some Parisian blue. Aww. Oh, and that was the most insane weekend ever. Now I know Paris is called the city of love and I can 100% see why, 
but it is also the city of have the most amazing time with your girls like I just cannot explain how wonderful it was to spend that quality time with such a group of fun loving beautiful amazing kind-hearted women it was just everything I needed and more and we just didn't stop giggling we didn't stop eating delicious food it's the most beautiful picturesque city ever we saw the prettiest parts of it and I'm just exhausted but in the best way in the best way and let me just say Maid of Honor Amy nailed it like I've never seen such attention to detail such thorough planning everything was seamless there was the perfect balance of like downtime to explore and also like fun loving lunches and and every restaurant we went to like I can't understand how she got a booking for 16 people at every single top restaurant in Paris. Like, it's just insane. You could tell Lottie was just so grateful for us all to be there, having an amazing time. And when you see someone surrounded by all of the people they love and they're so grateful for it, it just, it's so warm and gorgeous. And I feel like I'm just using all of the obvious adjectives to explain this weekend. It was honestly amazing. My only regret, my only regret is I didn't get to hunt down a vegan croissant. I really wanted to go up and order it in a French accent but we'll have to wait for that next time there will be another time I barely get to see Maeve as well because she lives in Dubai so I barely get to see her the quality time with her was amazing meeting some of Lottie's friends that I've heard so much about but never spoken to or never met in person it was honestly just phenomenal so I am going to have an extremely early night this evening there is luggage underneath my eyes because of the lack of sleep from the last three days so I'm gonna unpack my case get all my washing sorted run myself a bath and just relive the giggles so anyway I hope you have enjoyed this video I don't think I've actually filmed that much because we were just having such an amazing time um, but I hope you've enjoyed watching I will be back next week with another video if you did enjoy it leave a thumbs up leave a little comment I'd love to know how you're doing um, and I'll speak to you guys very very soon lots of love